Whoa. It says, I will kill you? Sitting atop a massive hill in rural Kentucky is a terrifying school from hell. It just said the warden in the same voice. Those who dare to enter find themselves face to face with a shadow man. I saw a shadow run past me too. I saw a shadow go from right to left. Look, he's there, dude. No way. Oh. Yes. Is it down the step? Down, down the step. step. Oh my God. No. <laughs> it's Eric. Oh. No. Oh. Eric. He did it. They like it, dude. Let's go. Guys, we're back. we are back and we are going to be going to the Olive Hill High, High School. school dude. This is our first school that we have ever filmed at. We've been to two schools and they both went badly. Yeah, and bad we luck. We didn't end up filming, so maybe third tries a charm. And we brought Eric for backup. Epic Paranormal is Let's back go, on the channel. Baby, baby. Right, well, for Eric e. Money, Let's go. Anyways, this is a massive school with a crazy dark history, and it is apparently very, very haunted. Maybe the most haunted school in Kentucky. We're approaching it, guys. Check that out, dude. Some of the history at this school is bad. The principal. More of the story was a jackass. Literally, there was like 103 steps to get inside of the school, and he would make the kids go all the way back down, and then all the way back up if they did Hold one on, wrong thing. Dude, yo, it's right wait, there. Actually, is that it? Yes, that's it right there. Oh my god! Sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off. It's on the hill, dude. It is hill. all the way up there, bro. Are those are steps right there. Look at the mural. Oh my god, those are there steps. They dude. Are. Oh my god, dude. That was huge. Okay, now I'm kind of freaking out a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. We're screwed. Oh, Those steps were really insane. I don't even want to park here. Imagine, Imagine walking imagine to school go. every day and then you have to walk up those steps and hope you don't get. I did. We're Ooh. working out for us. Let's go meet up with Eric for the first time in months. It's been and, a while. Um, go investigate the Olive Hill High School. Let's here. do it. Ready, bro? Let's do it. All right, let's go. Jack, hey, money! What's up, dude? Were you it's not recording? Eric, I, I no. Got, I was, dude, okay. You were scared. You were oh scared. Oh my god! You, I didn't see you. I didn't see if you reacted. What's up, man? Dude, he was god, freaking. I walked out the corner. Well, look, he was just walking right look, there. Well, and that was off. So I, 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 oh, okay. shadow. I just looked like <laughs> Shadow Man coming up on you guys. Eric, would you like to read the history with us? Absolutely. All right, history time. History, history time. time. Let's, Let's go. go. All right, y'all. History time, baby. History. History time. There is a lot of history on this place. And some of it is a little creepy to say the least, especially yeah. the hauntings that we just found out about. Oh yeah. You ready? Let's do it. All right. The Olive Hill High School. Standing atop a massive hill in the rural city. A that was a scream. What the hell? That didn't even sound real. No, that sounded like... That sounded like from like somewhere else. Yes. Or like she was being suffocated or something. Yeah, it was like... It was like, like it was muffled. like phantomy, like... like yeah, it like faded in and out type thing. Standing atop a massive hill in the rural city. A Standing atop a massive hill in the rural city. A Standing atop a massive hill in the rural city. A it was that way. Maybe, Think about but how like. How loud that scream had to Yeah, because, dude, okay, look how big this hill is, man. Look how big this hill is. You see down there? Yeah, I mean. Look how far the cars are down, dude. I just got. Dude, Ooh. that reminded me of Gettysburg, dude. Yeah. Oh my god, that dude. Deja, that's like yeah. exactly it, what it, happened. It, dude. What the? Shh, shh, film, film. film. I'm recording on mine. That was screaming. Dude, dude wait. Heard scream. That was a male scream. That was a pure terror scream. Yeah, it was. I'm on edge. That was weird. Anyways. I hope everyone's all right, because that, that was like yeah, a that was real really deal scream. Curdling scream. That was not like a, hey, this is funny. All right. Standing atop a massive hill in the rural city of Olive Hill, Kentucky, the Olive Hill High School has stood a beacon for almost 100 years. Built in 1929, the school was designed as a five-bay, two- and three-story load-bearing brick building. It was a combination of Romanesque and Federal styles, aka it looks like a creepy-ass old school. Yeah, yeah. That's, what I read right there. <laughs> that's what I read. Four additional classrooms were added in the mid-1950s, flanking the original building with two classrooms on either side. With a long history of education and prosperity, Olive Hill High School was one of the longest running schools in the entire nation. Wow. I actually did not know that's that. That's crazy. That's cool. That's cool. And it has original wooden lockers in there, dude. 
still. Like, that, that, I've know. never seen that, dude. I've never seen that before. They weren't yeah. just regular wooden walk lockers. The children that used the lockers built them for themselves so they could have a locker. That's a, that's a good point. The reason we were told that they did that is because the school just didn't have enough money to buy lockers. Yeah. So they were forced to build their own. Mm -hmm. Principal Hayden Parker, a strict disciplinarian, was spotted peering out of the school's window from his office. Mr. Parker would spend his morning overlooking the steps as the kids walked up and shouted at the students to slow down and stop misbehaving. He would sit and wait until someone disobeyed his rules. It's twisted. One wrong move and Mr. Parker would storm down from his office and make the kids walk all the way down and back up again. So he was sitting there just waiting for them to make a mistake. He was, he was sitting there waiting to be an asshole. You wanna know one thing that's crazy? Is Mr. Parker's office is right there. That's where they- Right there. Home. So he had that window open all morning and would just stare at the children while they would walk up the and stairs. And that's a big ass staircase too. So to make kids go all the way back down and come back up, like look at that dude, that's crazy. I wouldn't want to do that every morning. That'd be like the worst start of my day. God, imagine just seeing the principal. You would just be devastated. Just, you'd try to avoid him at all costs. Yeah. Yeah. But tonight, we're going to be inviting him out. Tonight, we're going to be seeing if he'll come up and talk to us, try and discipline us. A kid who went to the school states that his parents advocated for corporal punishment and was told that if they ever got a paddling at school, that was nothing compared to what they would get when they got home. Different times. Yeah. And imagine, yes. imagine kids coming here with that energy. You know, that energy doesn't leave. I, just, I bet at my middle school and high school, there's some energy that's never leaving. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> some Eric energy left behind, oh, some dude. other energy. My, my time in school was miserable. Yeah. Back in this time, kids who misbehave in school would get paddled in front of everyone, leaving marks, welts, and bruising on their bodies. This was an everyday event, and kids were punished on a daily basis. With strict rules, the kids who attended were always in fear and on edge. I can imagine. Yeah. I can that, actually that imagine. That comes from top down. That's systemic. That's Mr. Hayden Parker is doing. This isn't just reported. These are people that are coming back to the school. Their names are signed on that board, and they are talking and reporting on Mr. Parker and yeah. how he was. So these are first-hand witnesses right. of his, like, wrath, I guess. The death of an Olive Hill man who was shot on the front steps of the building after a lethal argument with another man led the town in distress. With the shooter being immediately arrested, he was charged with the first degree murder. He was later held with a $250,000 cash only bond. Wow. For murdering a man right where we're sitting. Literally on these steps, dude. And that was only in 2017. This that was so extremely recent, bro. So imagine the history of the school and then that energy on top of it. What's that gonna do to this place? Yes, yeah, but it's time for the hauntings. Let's do it. Let me start it off. You got it. On the second floor, teachers and students used to hear people walking on the original floorboards while class was still in session. When they would look out the door windows to see where the sound was coming from, no one could be seen in the halls. These sounds are still heard to this very day, and also lockers have been known to slam on their own. If I capture that, you're gonna catch me um, outside. Shadow figures can be frequently seen peeking around doors on every single floor of this building. However, after a menacing shadow figure was seen in what is now known as the dungeon, paranormal investigators were called into the building to try to capture it on camera for themselves. To this very day, the dungeon is one of the most active locations in the entire building, bringing with it a feeling of dread and despair that is almost impossible to escape. All right, Eric, the last haunting bit. The last haunting, all right. Oh, oh <laughs> It's got real. It just got real. On the first floor, the faces of children and even the former principal Hayden Parker have been seen still peering out of the front facing windows. It is believed that Mr. Parker is still watching to see if the kids will mess up on their long walk up the front steps. That's insane. And he has been spotted right there. Yes. In another terrifying encounter, an employee was taking measurements in the janitor's room when he places the measuring tape down next to him. Upon looking up from his work, it was in the middle of the hallway, having been moved almost 10 feet away from where it was placed. Not only that, but when he reached down to grab it off the floor, he saw a full-bodied apparition walking through the exit, heading back up to the stairs where it came from. That story gave me chills, man, when we were told that. It's already been crazy. The, like, just the tour, the history, goal achieved, just sitting Let's here. Go, hey, Let's, go. Hey, Let's go. We did it. That's what I'm saying. Goal achieved. That's how. That's silly. <laughs> right at the end of the history segment. Goal, goal achieved. achieved. They baby. know it's up. They know it's up. <laughs> but yeah, it is. So 
we've had a couple of omens already. Let's see where that leads us tonight. I'm curious because it, it chills seems, again. Seems like it's gonna be active. This is gonna be our first video at a haunted school. Let's do it. Y'all ready to go in? Let's do ready. it. All right, let's do it. Let's head in. Ready spaghetti. Guys, we are here outside of the Olive Hill High School. How are you guys feeling? Dude, what? Dude, it's been nuts already and we haven't yeah. even started. Literally. Dude, just look up there. It is menacing as hell. It is actually really? huge, bro. It's huge. It's on a hill too. It's like it's like old hospital, but on a it's a school on a hill. Like Olive yeah. Hell. Olive <laughs> Hell? Olive yeah. Hell. Oh, that was man. A, that was the cringiest man. thing I've said all night. <laughs> right now we have a crazy experiment going. Jake is gonna fill us in on the details. It's running as we speak. Guys, so as you know, Principal Hayden Parker was known to stare out of his office window at the children as they walked up these steps every single day. And it said that if they messed up even a little bit, he would send them right back down just to walk back up again until they got it right. Yeah. And so we decided that as we enter the school for the first time to investigate, we have set up an entire room up there and one of the windows where faces have appeared peering out in photos and we have a bunch of gear set up and i can see the music box going off literally right now but we've set it up in case he gets pissed off and wants to say something we have the gateway in there we have a mel meter and we have a uh, music box so yeah. and we're, we're gonna purposely be fools walking up these stairs yeah. we're gonna do everything in our power to get a response out of mr parker here it's cool so man. get ready for some tomfoolery all right let's see so this. this on the right side would be where you're supposed to walk up okay. this is where you're supposed to walk down so start with us and okay. then we'll start switching over all right i hate school <laughs> no no you didn't do your homework no guess what i didn't do mine either hey let's, let's, go. Go. let's go eric did you do your homework yeah. Oh, oh damn. Psych! No! Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay. Boom. 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 We're on the left side. Oh, I'm gonna hit some moves over here. <laughs> well, I ain't walking normal today. All right. Wrong side, Mr. Parker. Yeah, he's gotta not be like. Yeah, I'm just kidding. Oh! <laughs> I'm just kidding. Mr. Parker, if you're in there, knock something over if you don't like what we're doing. Watch this. I'm gonna walk it backwards. Oh, what I'm gonna kick you in the face. <laughs> that's, not a, that's not a kick. I'm gonna punch you in the face. <laughs> I'm gonna crawl on the floor. You're the one crawling on all fours. Uh, all right. Well, I guess let's go in, see what's going on in there, and yeah. start exploring. Yeah, and here, I'm gonna hit record on the Sony Saint as we walk in. Okay. Oh, dude. Just to dude. see what happens. All right, here, this is our first steps inside Catch Olive breath, Hill. Yeah, hold on, yeah, because we're gonna be breathing deep in there. It's the gateway. Oh it's the God. gateway, dude. I thought it was a train. That sounded like a shout. Back to school, baby. Again. Back to school. We're back at it again. All right. Let's Ready? Let's get in record as we breach the door. Who's in here? Let's check the experiment. Yes. And then I've got something to show you guys. Oh, yeah. Once, once, we, once we're done in here. Okay. That was it is. It is. It is. What's going on? Wow. Mr. Parker, are you in here? Hello? Hey! Hey! Hello! So these are the windows he would have stared out right here. Yeah. Mr. Parker? Are you here? We heard you from out there. We're the ones walking on the steps just now. Are you in here with us? Are you there? What? He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. Who? Who's coming? The principal. I swear it said the principal. You heard that? Yes. It did. You're and, right. And then it got cut off on the re replay thing. All right. Is, he, is, he, is the principal mad at us? Experiment. Is it experiment? Oh my god, it did. What? Now I'm sad. What? Now I'm sad. Or on the is steps. It's it down the steps. Down, down the steps. steps. Down it down wants us to go back down because we fucked up. Oh, that's dude. dude. What? That's literally. Oh my oh god. god, dude. 
the experiment. No I just way. asked if we were in trouble, and it said the experiment. Go down this. It was like telling us to go back down. Yes. Oh my yep. god. Oh wow. That's insane. <gasps> Dude, it worked. It worked. The experiment worked. It did. Who knows what kind of stuff we got when we were outside goofing the hell around? True. No. If you're happy to talk to us, can you say welcome or hello? If you're stoked on this. Hello! Oh, oh my god. god! And it's the girl voice! Yeah, it's not the dude, it's the girl this voice. This is wild, dude. This I is can't wild. believe it already worked. That's yeah. nuts. That was sick. We're gonna go upstairs. We need the upstairs hallway for this. Yeah. Cool. For what for us about to happen. Let's do it. Let's head up. Let's Will you come upstairs with us? Who wants to skip class today? All of us do! <laughs> dude, that's going crazy! It's it's in like all of us, I've been leaving. Dude, it's glitching out. It's glitching out. It stopped scanning, dude. It would not start scanning again. Wow, Holy crap. <laughs> Just like glitched out the gateway. All right, so you all, I don't know what you're all gonna think about what's about to happen. Are you serious? I, I don't, I cannot, I can't even imagine y'all's reaction. I don't think y'all have ever even seen what I'm about to do in a video. What's that? Oh, no, that's not it. What the? <laughs> I was right. Wait, what's what? What is all this? Wait, what is all? This? There's no way to just have to. Yo, what? Nerf! Are we about to have a Nerf war? It's Nerf or nothing. No way, baby. Are we about to be nerfing it up in here? Hold no on. way. To start off tonight's investigation, we're gonna have a Nerf war. So each person has a gun. Okay. Each person has a camera. Who's ready? <laughs> Okay guys, we just want to clarify that we are doing this to spark energy at a school because this is what kids, um, the age of these high schoolers that would have gone here like to do. They like to play Nerf. They like to hang out and have fun. So don't take this in any other way. Nerf gun fight is about to start. Y'all ready? Position. It's Nerf or nothing. Nerf or nothing. Three, two, one, go. No! <laughs> no one's all the way down there. But oh, oh my headshot! Oh my God. <laughs> No! <laughs> Got it. Sure. No! Go for it! Go for it! Oh. No! 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 Oh, I got him! Yes! I got him! Oh, he's coming in! He's coming in! Oh, right in the That was kind of crazy. That was awesome, dude. <laughs> what the? Woo! All right, we before, did the before we do anything else, it's time to clean. That is going to spark some energy, dude. I hope so. That was that, I mean, that was crazy. That is energy all day. Yes. So, dude, what if it like pops off after this? Dude, what if it's like? We proved ourselves right. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. So, dude, good stuff. Dude. That was awesome. <laughs> I'm freaking out. Okay, that was insane. That was crazy. Holy crap! I have never ever done that, and I did not expect that you were gonna bring that stuff here to have a nerf war, dude. Seriously, that was yeah. insane. I've never done that either. Nerf yeah. gun war at a haunted location. Yeah. That was sick. Yep. That 100%. was sick. Hundred percent. So hopefully our energy is gonna bring their energy up, but just in case it doesn't. I've got one more experiment. Ooh, baby. One more experiment, Ooh, baby. So we're gonna bring even more energy into this place. It's something familiar, but something weird. And here, I'll show you. I'll show you. Okay. What dude, could that what be? Did Eric's always got something off his sleeve? Is it in there? Part of it. What, what the hell is that, bro? <laughs> so <laughs> this is a. Daedric summoning statue. No, I'm kidding. Whoa, whoa, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> whoa. <laughs> Skyrim reference. No, it's a, this is a Tesla coil. Oh, okay. It's, oh, a, it's a plasma ball, but this one is unique. This is the strongest one that I've ever encountered. So we're going to set this one up in the middle right here. Okay. But, you know, that might not be enough energy. You know, that's just one little area, yeah. you know. So I've brought two, Yo. two more vintage Tesla coils. <laughs> Dude. Oh, my. That's Crazy. awesome. And so we're gonna have the dragon one in the middle and then yep. another one at each end. Dude. So it is gonna electrify literally yep. the atmosphere that we're in. And so if spirits are made up of energy, then this will literally fuel them to do whatever we ask. Answer questions, 
you know, make objects move, all that yeah. kind of stuff. This should help them a lot. So watch this, watch this. So, but I tested dude, this. Dude. Okay, that's, cool. that's lighting up, actually. Can you back away if these balls are... Can you touch that one single time if these are helping you? Do you feel stronger and more intelligent? Do you feel alive now? Did you see us with the Nerf guns? Can you give... Oh, yes! Right there! Sorry, dude. Oh so God. they saw us with the Nerf guns. Yes. So depending on how you do this video, this might yeah. be... But the spirits are reacting to the Nerf gun war that we just had Yes. There. In order to spark the energy in this hallway. And did you like the Nerf war? If you did, can... Oh, yeah! Oh Eric, God. we did it! They we liked did. it, dude! Every experiment so far has worked. Are you alright? Dude, <laughs> it's loud noises. It scares him. He stuns him. It's like a stun gun to him. Dude. That's what we figured out recently. It's like when I scream, that's when he gets like all like freaked out. Like freak oh maybe it's freaking them out too. <gasps> yeah. But no, that dude, that's amazing. That's yes. wild. Wait. Do you want your own gun so you can play? Do you just want to watch? Are you skipping class right now? That was me. Are you one of the students here? Did you go to Olive Hill School? Oh, what did he said? Lizzie earlier, remember? Lizzie? Who? Uh, Marshall. Oh. Didn't he say is Lizzie here? Yeah. Lizzie! Oh my God! Dude. Lizzie, hello. If this is Lizzie, stand back, please. Oh my god! Dude, it's Lizzie! Dude! We don't even know who, who Lizzie is. Who's Lizzie? Should we call Marshall? Marshall just mentioned call her. Call Marshall. Quick Marshall call. Dude, that's crazy. Dude. Yeah, we need to get the lowdown. We need to get the lowdown on who Lizzie is. Yeah. Hello. Hey Marshall, sorry if we woke you up, man. We have a question. What's that? Were you talking about a spirit named Lizzie in here earlier? Uh-huh. Who, oh, who, okay. who is that? Lizzie? Yeah. I'm not sure. I haven't. I haven't. The, the layers are so deep on that place, man. And we're still trying to figure out who Lizzie is. Oh, okay, but it is a spirit that you've contacted. Oh, we have contacted Lizzie. Well, there. awesome. Think... Okay, all right. We we appreciate it, Marshall. Thank you, dude. There is a spirit named Lizzie. Wow, that's Lizzie awesome. Here. Marshall confirmation. confirmation. That's <laughs> jinx. It just went up. Yes, it just went one time. Bing. Hello, Lizzie. Lizzie, you're amazing. You know that, Lizzie. Do you see the hallway of the school, like with the lockers? Oh my yes. god! Yes, dude. Huh. Lizzie, did you go to school at Olive Hill? Oh! Wow! Confirmation! Yes. Immediately! Yes. Is your locker on this hallway? Is your locker down on the first floor? Right below us. Did your locker used to be on the third floor where we can't go today? We have a I, Lizzie, do you not remember where your locker was? Oh my god! Because I was thinking because ghosts have a hard time like remembering they things don't have possibly. A yeah. Dude, here, let's take an AI picture and see if she's really yeah. gonna do it. Guys, so that nerf war that we had in this hallway, I don't know if it's gonna be in this video. If it is, you saw it. If it's not, it's on Patreon, but it definitely worked. And now Lizzie is talking with us. Lizzie, you're awesome. Can you bear with us for a second? It was literally right behind. Yes! Oh, wow. Thank you, Lizzie. Thanks, Lizzie. Lizzie, you're actually pretty fire. And that's a compliment. Okay, so Eric is taking AI photos right now to Let's try go. to capture anything over there. And this is a new AI. Well, it, they've had it for a while. Whoa. Okay, look. So what I want to do, this is called AI expansion. And what it does is it uses AI to fill out the scenes around the picture. <laughs> so it makes the picture bigger yeah. with an artificial image. What I want to do is I'm going to take a picture to the right of the music box and to see if we can see her using the music box. Awesome. Wouldn't that be insane? Lizzie, are you up for that? We're going to find you on a picture. Is that cool? So here, stand next to the music box like you were. And I'm going to take your picture right now. Three, two, one. Oh! She's still oh there! God. Dude, she's standing there right no now. Way. Here, let's try another picture. Let's try a different AI. Here, I'm taking your picture right now. Three, two, one. Photo! Stand there, Lizzie. Oh, the, she was there! Oh, I turned it off! Crap. Look, she's there, dude! No way! Oh! And she's in the open space. Look, so that this dude. is this is important for the research part of it. 
She's not. St- it's not like she's made out of a locker. She's not made out of a locker. She's in the My open God. hallway. She's standing in the open hallway. Show it to Lizzie. Lizzie, check it out. We got a picture of you. Does that does that look like you? If that looks like you, can you light that up for us? I wonder what they may not be able to see screens. Dude, can, can you can you see what he's holding in his hand? Can you see anything on here? I'll turn the brightness up. Maybe that's not if if you can see it, can you light up the music box to say yes? Okay, if you cannot see what he's holding, can you light that up for me? Oh, she wow. Can't, she can't see it? Wow. Oh, okay, here. Let this me is here. insane Listen. paranormal research happening right now, dude. This is crazy. This is amazing. Here, is like, there's a weird vibe right now. Yeah, I, I was... I'm feeling like well, energy around the building. I feel, yeah. like my, I feel like in my chest. My chest feels very I, stiff. Really. I feel light headed as hell there's it feels like something's like i feel like i around the building right now you know when you blow up a crap ton of balloons and you're like whoa that's exactly how i feel and you know what we're getting such clear communication and then this and then maybe something's like noticing what's happening and they're like you can't be doing this you know like some kind of like enforcer force dude maybe that's what they were talking about like he's or it's coming it's an it's coming yes lizzie is there a force for you is there is there something that is telling you what to do. You know, like some kind of enforcer or police officer style person, authoritarian. The principal. Authority figure, that's what I mean. Yeah, authority figure. If there's someone telling you what to do, could you light that up one last time? Oh, it hadn't gone off in a while. Dude, is it the principal, Mr. Parker? 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 Is it hard? It, looked, it went off for a while. Dude. So you're saying the authority figure is Hayden Parker. And he doesn't like that we're talking to you right now. Is that true? Is there a TV on? Do you hear that? Yes. That's why I like perked up a little bit. I don't hear it. I'm not hearing it now. It sounded like a TV, with, like a movie really? was playing. I feel like I'm in a different dimension. I feel... The most I feel free. Euphoric. Yeah, dude. I and like free. off. I feel like if I walk out the front door, it'll just be a white plane. I know that sounds nuts. I feel so I don't know if it's the energy. It's gotta be the energy. Lizzie, is there something affecting the air right now? Affecting our environment? Is it making us feel weird? Is it Mr. Parker? Is he a dark force in this building? This is only the second time I've ever used this on location, and the first time was by accident. We are going to record a video with audio, obviously, and then we're going to put it through an AI voice detection program mm-hmm. that changes the voice, but it also detects voices. I do want to say real quick, it's essentially an AI EVP session. We're using yes. AI to capture EVPs. So let's do this. Yeah. Here, try and talk on the device I'm holding in my right hand. Lizzie, are you still with us? Try to talk as loud as you can. Can you say hello? Mr. Parker, if you're here, I want you to say something to us right now. Oh my God. Mr. Parker, is that you? Please try and speak to us with this. There was just a tap in there. So if that was you, Lizzie, can you say hello? Okay, I heard it again. Could you scream as loud as you can? Please try and speak to us with this. There was just a tap in there. So if that was you, Lizzie, can you say hello? Okay, I heard it again. Could you scream as loud as you can? Dude, loud tap. Make a louder noise for us, please. What the hell? If you can hear me, can you knock twice like this? Is that Lizzie back there? Immediately. Lizzie? Could you make a real life sound for us if that's you? 
Here, try to mimic this for me. It, it just, just did, did the, the two! two taps. It just did the two taps. It just taps. did the two taps, dude. It went tap, tap. I get like a pendulum now. <laughs> is this still Lizzie? Is this the principal now? Are you mad? Is this a different... What was that for? Different spirit or principal? You, you didn't even have to finish that. Mr. Parker? Oh my god. Mr. Immediate. Are you, Mr. Parker, hold on. Are you mad at us? <laughs> <laughs> Why don't wait for them long? That was like what comedic timing for Mr. Parker. Listen, yeah. I wonder, so do you think Mr. Parker's lightened up in here or do you think he's gotten more aggressive? Which one was that? Hold on, hold on, back away. But did you lighten up? Are you chilling with us? Are you more aggressive with us? Are you, like, are you angry? Are you okay with people coming here to talk to you, to try and reach you? If you... Okay. We're gonna take that as a yes, okay? Alright, let's listen to this. Yeah, let's do it. Could you scream as loud as you can? <laughs> can you scream as loud as you can? And then, and then it finally went off. Alright, so... No. We are going into the dungeon. Uh, what's a school doing with the dungeon? You tell this, me. This tell is me. the room where all of this started. The people who work here, they saw a shadow figure in the dungeon and called Marshall and Blue Collar Paranormal. Yes. And they were like, we have a problem here. And that led to us being here. So, so are you ready for the dungeon? <laughs> no. Are you? He's ready for that Denny's. Yeah, he, <laughs> Noah, always thinking about Noah's Denny's. already gone from tonight, so. <laughs> Okay, but seriously, this could be the most active part, so let's really uh, dive in. So when they first started investing, the first time Blue Collar Paranormal investigated, they said they spent three hours in this tiny dungeon. Yes. Help. It, it does feel like a different location in here. It does. It doesn't feel like you're in a school anymore. Okay, so I do want to clarify as well that the reason they call it the dungeon is because of the dark apparition and because of like the feeling of dread and sorrow and like dizziness and all that that the people feel. And the way it's named structured, dude. Yeah. It, I mean, Look at the structure. Yeah. All right. I do want to say I just put a music box facing the doorway in case anyone wants to come Whoa. down. Whoa. Okay. I don't what? know if it's just getting late. Dude. Dude, what? So the, the, the steps. So Noah was like here and then behind, I, I saw a girl in a white dress with black hair like the ring. What? It looked like the f the ring standing in front of the steps i Wait, think right in front yes i think it was my eyes playing tricks on me maybe with the pipes and stuff but like dude i swear it looked like a girl was standing there white dress i know the ai is moving capturing our black dresses but it was a white dress black hair looked like out of a freaking japanese horror movie dude if if eric saw you can you confirm please by making that music box light up Get in front of that, it'll go off, and we'll know you're here. We also have a spirit box that'll amplify your voice. Did I just see you? Here, let me turn it up. Did I just see you? Say the, I thought I heard standing in the doorway. I swear what? to God, dude. dude. We'll, we'll have to listen back, but if you, that's what you, it was like, standing, standing in the doorway. Is was, that you? Did I see you? Trouble or exactly, exactly. dude. It's like exactly. Who is that? Was it a girl? Is it Lizzie? Yes. Can you say the name Lizzie if that's who we just saw? Yeah. Lizzie, if that was you, can you say Lizzie loud and clear? Absolutely? Yeah. Did absolutely. Say, I was like, well, absolutely. I heard like a well before. Like, yeah, well, absolutely. Okay, then can you say Lizzie, please, to confirm? Screaming. You got it. Lizzie, do you like hanging out with us? Is the principal here, Mr. Parker? Say correction? It, it was a male voice too, right out of reaction. Mr. Parker, is that you? It is. Did you just say it is? I thought I said no. 
I thought it said you know it. Oh, okay. <laughs> I think I think it was you know it. Honestly, you know it. Okay, you know that it? sounds more right. Yes. Hello, Mr. Parker. Who's the girl with dark hair? Do you know her? Do you know who that is? Lizzie, if you talk into this, we might be able to hear you. Can you give it a try? All right, I'm slowing it back down. It just said you. I thought it just said you. Dude, what? Right as I right as I'm starting to walk over there. Yeah, it just went. Oh my god, dude. What? Dude, like what? That didn't sound natural at all. That sounded like... Because it, it like, kept yeah. scanning, and it came through over multiple, like... That gave me a weird vibe. Are you screaming? Who's screaming? Can you hear me? Is that what you just said? Sir, yes, we just heard you. Who are we talking to? The warden. That's my. It hurt. just said yeah. the warden the in the warden. same voice that we heard at Billy, Billy Creek. Creek Village, dude. Who are we talking to? Who are we talking to? Who are we talking to? And what if that's when they said it's coming? What if they're talking about the warden? That's dude, the same. It, and we, dude, I have damn chills all That was like body. PTSD. Dude, because at, at Billy Creek, we thought the warden was like the controller of all the other spirits. Right. And you asked that earlier to Lizzie, is there like a controller? And yeah. then boom. Yeah. But also they did used to call like principals that were like that wardens as well. Right. Like they did. Well, and think about this. It was like the warden though. It was the exact same voice. The warden. Like just like that, dude. Just like Billy. And you just had the warden come through. And what happened at the very beginning of the night during the history? The scream like at Gettysburg. Yes. yes. A bunch of stuff happening from the past investigations you all have been on. It's like it's like all coming through here right now exactly. for some reason. And that's not normal. <laughs> that's, no. that's that's very strange. This is a not normal night. This is crazy, dude. This is very weird. This is very weird. All right, let's turn this back up and let's ask the warden, like, who's the warden? Yeah. Who is the warden? Can you tell us where the warden is from? Is the warden here different from the warden they know? It might. It might. It might. I heard it, it might. It literally. might. You're saying it might be different? Is Mr. Parker the warden here? No. no. Direct response. Dude. I'm gonna go like that, I'm not gonna lie. Where is the warden from? Alright, here, Jake, you hold it for a second. Do you know Jake and I? Did it say turn your light off? Can we switch tonight? Do you, do you want our lights off? Alright, here, let's go in here for a second. Here, if we get close, if we get close to you, will you say "found me" or "right here"? I thought it just says "found you." Yeah, I did too. I didn't say it was, it was like, like "found, found you. you." Where? Right there. Found right you. when we walked in. Yeah, right, right there. It was like "found you." Hello. This is Eric. Can you hear me? I heard a very faint. Yeah. yeah. It was like, yeah. If you talk to this, we'll hear you. Can you say your name loud and clear? That was a voice. Can you say one of our names loud and clear? My stomach's starting to hurt. All right, here, let's try EVP. I was gonna, yes. Okay, I am just more confused than ever. I don't know if we're talking to like, a different dimension or ghost or There's the warden. There's not been any like really intelligence here. It's just, well, it's been all over the Lizzie. place. Lizzie. Yeah, Lizzie. Lizzie like a little bit. It just keeps on changing. Like It's here. almost like Lizzie's the main character. There's just a bunch of things going on around it. Let's ask if Lizzie's here. I if the like principal's here. here. I actually feel like I'm about to... Do you need to step out? Actually, maybe. Hold on. If your mouth waters run. Yeah, it's, it's run. watering. You want to step out real quick?
I don't know what to do because I don't want to like go and then it's okay. We're if okay, we're good. We're good. I'll be good. We're good. Okay. Sure. Yeah, if it gets bad, I'll tell you. It's just, I'm getting the mouth watering feeling though. All right, hitting record. Here, when you see the orange light, that means we'll hear your voice. So talk as loud as you can right now. Lizzie, how many spirits are with you? How many people are with you? Is someone making me feel sick? Who's standing next to Jake? Who's the warden? All right, so we're gonna listen to this, guys, and see if we got any voices. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's, oh, dude, no, it says, there's a faint voice that says, get out of here, and then another voice goes, get out, right before I start talking. What? L listen, it's... Oh, like something's moving down there. Something's moving. Something's moving. Did you not hear? I freaking heard that. It was something was moving. Yes. Hello? It sounded like a snake. Don't f***ing say that. It's dude. It did. God damn it. <laughs> it did. I'm not doing that. It did. Move again. Right then. Yes. Right as soon as you said it. Okay. Do you want us out of here? Move something. Throw something. Dude, it said, get out of here, get out, Dude, and then we hear what yes. sounds like a snake. Dude, play that again, too. Uh, yeah. Remember the hiss? How many spirits? God. <laughs> Sorry. That's it. Wait, hold on, I missed it. Hold on. That's it. Lizzie. Yep. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Lizzie. Yeah. How many spirits are with you? How many people are with you? I just it went on for like five seconds. It was like a you heard it? Yes. Dude, no, you remember they said they spent three hours down here, and I'm starting to see why. Yeah, it's it, weird. It's starting to pick up and be weird. Okay, okay, let's get I through this. I think we found a loophole. I think we found a loophole. <laughs> Literally. Is someone making me feel sick? Who's standing next to Jake? Whoa, dude! Who's standing next to Jake? Is this, does it say broadhead? No, no, wait, wait, wait. Who's standing next to Jake? Dude, wait, wait, wait. I hear okay. him. Okay, dude, I hear Remember me, broadhead. Who's standing next to Jake? Oh my god, there's, there's more after this. Remember me, brought at Jake. That's what I hear. Standing next to Jake. Okay. I don't know, I don't know what I mean. Oh my, I don't know. Jake. I don't know. Who's the warden? Whoa. Is this. I will kill you? I will it, de it definitely says I will kill. Definitely. I will kill. I will kill. I got I will damn kill. chills. You can't see him. Oh my god. This is, that it one's 100%. Might, it might say I will kill tonight. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, it does. There's like a tonight that comes through. Dude, this this what? room feels like a portal to like a bunch of different stuff to me. Like bad, good, the damn enforcers, random ass spirits. I feel like everything is in here. Whatever the damn snake thing is back yeah, there. Yeah, what was that back yeah. there, man? Hey, I need to listen to the end of that again. Yeah, yeah. Dude, it, it definitely says I will kill. I will kill. And life so or tonight or something, but I will kill. Dude, All it right. definitely says I will kill, dude. Let's get out. Let's get through. Anyways, very confusing Ooh. night in my opinion yeah, here. I think, again, another location that's going to deserve a second attempt. Especially this last part. I am just leaving so damn I don't confused. even feel like... I feel sick question. I question myself question. Yeah. yeah this like, is the, what happened? Like, what just happened? Yeah, it's just that, weird. That's you went from we're... nurse battling to... 
talking to things that wants to kill Jake. Well, I have I to know. say that Eric's nerf battle worked, dude, because we got some <laughs> crazy changed, It changed, dude. It, it changed. Did. It did. But I think for sure there is a spirit here named Lizzie. We were definitely yes. intelligent, and I also think Mr. Parker is 100% here. Yeah, absolutely. And whatever this warden thing is, whether it's Mr. Parker or something else, I don't know. And then is the thing from Broadhead still following us? Possibly. I don't know. Well, I don't know. Dude, earlier when you walked so during our live streams, Jake went and did a solo. And when you left, I recorded an EVP, and the only voice we got on the EVP was a voice that said, I followed him. Yeah, I remember that. And we were thinking it was a spirit that just went with you. Yeah, you know, that's what I was thinking too. But what if it's the spirit from Broadhead saying, okay, I well followed then, him? I think then this might be a good chance to maybe even record the blessing later. So we did request that Eric brought some things to help bless us after the whole broadhead thing because it's been going on for months yeah. and we're done with it. Go subscribe. Go subscribe to Epic Paranormal. Epic Paranormal, let's go! Right there. Follow him on TikTok. Comment your theories about who or what we came into contact with tonight. And Noah, what do they need to remember? Remember, anything, and I mean anything, is possible even when you investigate and stay overnight in one of the most haunted schools in the world. We'll see you in the next one.